एवरी वन आई यू पेला सेफ एंड डूइंग गुड सो इन दिस वीडियो यू विल डिस्कस इफ आई हैड टू री स्टार्ट माई करियर और मोर प्रिसाइजली इफ आई से इफ आई हैड टू री स्टार्ट माई कोडिंग जर्नी फ्रॉम अ फ्रेश देन वॉट वुड बी माई स्ट्रेटेजी वॉट आई विल लर्न विच लैंग्वेज टेक्नोलॉजी फ्रेमवर्क और इन विच डायरेक्शन आई एल गो वॉट वुड बी माई पाथ और यू कैन से वॉट एडवाइज आई विल गिव टू माई सेल्फ राइट सो दिस थिंग विल बी डिस्कसिंग इन दिस वीडियो सो मेनली If this is the case with my with me, then I'll focus mainly on three things. So basically, three things we'll discuss in this video, right? First thing, I will learn JavaScript definitely. Yeah, no Java, Python, or C plus plus. I'll go for JavaScript because this is according to my personal interest. I want to go in this development field actually, right? But apart from this interest kind of thing, from job point of view also, this is a very good field to go. into right because there are many job opening also for software developer jobs as we know salary is also good like you you will get a good package so this is also a point to go into this field web development field right so i learn first javascript definitely right it's not like that this is the only way but it's my interest and definitely javascript is no scaling it is now everywhere everywhere almost right so this is having a very good scope you can enter into the tech industry with this field also i mean using your development skills learn web dev and you can enter into this tech field and you can reach up to a very good level into those mang fang companies as well right so yeah i know actually that another path is also there like uh, go for dsa if you are good in that field that or in that thing also dsa kind of thing then you can also enter into the these companies right like if you are from a good college and these type of companies the top tech companies are coming to your college for on campus placement so definitely in interview they ask dsa question almost in every round so based on that also if you are having one or two project you know and uh, not very very good project but you have like yeah good project and you are very good in dsa in problem solving you have those skills then definitely you have a great chance to enter into these companies but yeah i know dsa is tough actually and uh, it's not possible for everyone to master dsa right those algorithms and all so in my case i'll choose that second path first javascript in web dev i'll i'll go in development type of uh, development field right then second thing i'll start working on projects yeah rather than you know uh, devoting or wasting more and more time uh, on those programs only like we do print hello world program or palindrome factorial fibonacci series pattern type of program and many programs are there these kind of and we 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 understand and we we know devote so much time by uh, you know to understand the concept behind these programs and you know just for writing these programs yeah that thing is also important right just devote you know dedicate your time for this thing also but not much 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 time start working projects as soon as possible right because this is very important when you are going to work on a start making simple project maybe just only you know by uh, that that front end only right by clicking on that button this would be this would happen or re redirect a page or these kind of things simple things then uh, attach or work on back end also have some database for your project because obviously in industry or in real life that would be required you have to deal with data also so you have you have some knowledge of if you have some knowledge of database that would be good for you then work on back end also have some database sql mysql or mongodb or any other database right connectivity and all so front end as well as back end because see uh, when we will be working on projects then these concept all these theory concept these loops concept or uh, those programs you write in the beginning those concept would be more clear to you guys when you work on project so this thing is important right start working on project as soon as possible i'll be doing this thing 
if I had to restart my journey, right? I'll start making projects, simple project, then high level project, intermediate level project, high level project, right? And yeah, once you will work in on projects and definitely you will stuck and you will have some doubts and you'll be frustrated, but it's okay. That is normal. It happens with everyone, with every fresher weekend or every beginner, right? So keep patience and everything will be fine. There is solution for every pro problem on internet if you search properly, right? So second thing, this thing I'll do, working on projects, right? Third thing, I'll maintain definitely my GitHub. This is very important nowadays. This is very crucial. Please maintain your GitHub profile. Right? Whatever you do, any project, small project, any project you have or whatever you have, upload that to GitHub. Right? Maintain your GitHub profile. That is important one because nowadays your online visibility is crucial, playing a crucial role. Right? Because sometimes it happens just by looking your Git profile, GitHub profile, LinkedIn profile or if you have any other, uh, any other uh, profile on any other coding platform right many coding platform uh, also they are nowadays so directly these recruiters contact you for you just directly got an interview call right they will not check your resume so one thing one advantage of this thing is what you don't have to focus on your resume like how, how should be your resume a perfect resume because directly you will get a call for interview just maintain your online portfolio Nowadays, this thing is important, right? Rather than, you know, I guess focusing more and more on your resume. So whatever you do, any project or anything, just maintain uh, that thing online. Whether it's your GitHub profile, or it's your LinkedIn profile or any other professional profile. That is important one. So this thing I will do definitely maintain my GitHub profile. So these three things definitely I'll do if I had to restart my coding journey. I hope these points will help you too, right? Now, if you want me to upload more these kind of, you know, videos, placement related or career related, coding related, then you can let me know in comment section. So now I'll see you in the next video. Till then, bye-bye. Take care.